Bedrock is unlocking low temperature distributed geothermal for the heating and cooling of buildings of any size, in any density, anywhere in the world. And that's unique because we envision that geothermal can decarbonize hundreds of millions of existing buildings all across the world, and that this can be done in the near future, we just need to scale it up now. Shallow geothermal is important for the world because heating and cooling of buildings actually drives as much as 10% of greenhouse gas emissions overall. Uh, heating and cooling is the biggest driver of energy costs and the largest source of carbon emissions in building operations. So people can be really excited about geothermal because geothermal heating and cooling enables net zero gas-free buildings, which is healthier and safer for the people who live and work in buildings. And it saves money for building owners all while decarbonizing one of the most carbon intensive components of our economy. We can install geothermal in a matter of weeks in a really large building. And as soon as that heat pump is in and those boreholes are drilled, that building can be carbon free for its heating and cooling. Um, and the price point that we are really excited to make possible for the first time in the 80 years that we've been doing geothermal heating and cooling in this country is to deliver a three to five year payback period for a geothermal heating and cooling system. And I especially love that geothermal has this really beautiful connotation of Mother Earth providing boundless, constant, safe, and clean energy that we need, but right here where we stand. There's just something really wondrous about that concept. And so I wanted to shift into geothermal because not only does it have uh, that kind of sense, energy security, but also the fact that what we're doing, geothermal heating and cooling, can have a massive impact right now. The science is there, doable, and it's low-hanging fruit in the decarbonization of our society.